ready, fight! Okay, here we've got two HM2 style pedals. We've got the Arion Metal Master and we've got the Behringer HM300 Heavy Metal, both of which are very, very cheap and plastic. Let's see how they stack up next to each other. This is the clean toe. <laughs> pedal set up in the required settings of everything on full let's see how they stack up let's start with the Arion So actually, uh, pretty different. Um, two pedals that are supposedly, I mean, this one is supposedly a fairly slavish copy. I guess this one is a little bit different. Quite a lot more bottom end uh, on this one. And this one does that really peaky mid range. Like it, it feels really resonant. Um, whereas this one, a little bit more rounded. Uh, let's see if we can get this one to sound a bit more like this one. I guess let's try dialing back the lows a little bit and see how it does. <laughs> Still more resonant in the in the mids. Uh, let's pull that mids there a little bit more. You know, they're, they're really they're EQ'd quite differently. Um, when you start pulling back the mids here, uh, the lows become a lot more prominent and they feel like lower lows, whereas this seat, the lows seem on this a little bit higher up, which makes them a bit more present. Um, also, I think the distortion characteristics are pretty different. Let's aim for as close to flat on the EQ so we can see how those stack up as well. focuses uh, okay uh, so distortion full EQ as flat as we can we can get it
Yes, they're really quite different. The EQ on them, the 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 low control on this one feels like it is. It, its center frequency is a bit higher, which is why you, you feel so much more of it. Whereas it, you hear more of it where you feel more of the lows here. Also, the distortion characteristics quite different. The Behringer is more compressed, um, whereas this is a bit more open and raw, I would say. Um, I know what you're thinking, and I'm thinking it as well. Let's turn them both on. The other thing, uh, just while I think about it, is this has a ton more volume on tap. Mm. Uh, throughout, we've had the level noticeably lower than on the Behringer. Um, so this one, if you were going to do the extra trick of smashing it into your amp, uh, this might pay off a bit more. So in uh, summary, um, two quite different pedals, despite the fact that they are from the same lineage. Uh, more open, more obviously bassy, does the searing, super compressed thing, uh, but better when you turn them both on together. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little shootout. We haven't done a shootout or a stack type video for a while. Um, let us know in the comments if you want to see more. In fact, let us know in the comments which one of these you prefer. Uh, be interested to uh, to find out what you will think as well. Um, if you enjoyed this, please subscribe to the channel. Check out our music on Bandcamp, longfallboots.bandcamp.com. We're on Facebook, facebook.com slash longfallboots. Twitter, at longfallboots. All that normal stuff. Uh, until next time, keep it keep it metal, guys. Keep, keep, keep it metal, guys. Keep, Terrible. It, Terrible. keep it metal, guys. Goodbye. Goodbye.